The 32nd annual Late Night in the Fog had everything from 12 straight to Tech 9, another 10K, and even a big 18 to brag about. A capacity crowd at Allen Fieldhouse took in one of college basketball's greatest preseason traditions, and this one did not disappoint. Several center court reunions kicked off the night, including a spotlight on Jayhawk Olympians, headlined by gold medalist Kyle Clemens, and the return of All-American and Kansas Sports Hall of Famer Tamika Dixon. Brandon Schneider's women's basketball team battled their male practice squad counterparts and emerged with a 34-13 win. McDonald's All-American Jessica Washington helped lead the way for the Kansas women in their 21-point route. Following the women's scrimmage, a banner for KU's 12th straight Big 12 Men's Basketball Championship was unfurled. Then came perhaps the night's best drama, a little deja vu of the $10,000 variety. Lightning does indeed strike twice in the fog. Brennan Bouchard's half-court make forced Coach Bill Self to write another $10,000 check, this time for Jordan Stiers, a sophomore from Independence. Then after the fans retreated the four songs from Kansas City's own Tech 9, the KU men took center stage. Crimson and the Blue squads played to a 48-all tie, with sophomore Carlton Bragg pacing the Crimson team, 18 points on 8 of 11 shooting. Fans will fill the field house again in exactly one month, KU men open up preseason play with Washburn.